AutoCAD provides several tools that allow us to measure distance, area, perimeter, and mass properties. With the use of polylines, measurements of area and perimeter can be done very quickly. And the ribbon tab, click the drop down under measure and select area. Now AutoCAD expects us to select points that will form a polygon. The area and perimeter of the polygon will then be calculated. AutoCAD can also calculate the area and perimeter of objects that define closed regions. This includes circles and rectangles, but also things like polylines. To activate this, right mouse click and select object. And now it wants you to select an object. Let's start with the inside polyline. You should have that the area is 25.03 and the perimeter is 22.84 as shown here. Well let's say we didn't want to know what the area was on the inside of the gasket. We're most concerned with the area of the gasket itself. How much rubber would be used when creating this part. In order to do that we're going to come back to repeat area by clicking on area again we're going to add area to it and this time we want to specify object and again object lets us select something like a polyline circle or rectangle in this case we're looking at the polyline we're going to select the outside polyline this time and again it selects anything that's inside of that polyline but we want to know what the inside part of our gasket would be. To access this option, right click and subtract area. Again to select the polyline we have to click on object and now the part that we are calculating is shown in green. The part we are subtracting out from the original calculation is shown in brown. If we click enter you should get that the total area is 12.33. You will be expected to know how to do this on quizzes and tests later.